يا الله اللهم صل على محمد وآل محمد ألم تولي مهدي وسلم تسليما السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وعليكم السلام براذا جيم and وعليكم السلام all أصار الله الحمد لله شكرا I'd like to tell you that today in the protest that we had in Sydney uh, Alhamdulillah, it was such an emotional event for all the Ansar, where the Ansar, or most of the Ansar of all of Australia, have gathered under one banner in, and under one hand, and we have went against uh, against the um, Iraqi consulate in Sydney, and as you've seen from the videos that we have uploaded. We have uh, protested peacefully, and the protest was full of men and children, women from all ages. Alhamdulillah, wa shukr. Yani Allah musalli ala Muhammad wa ali Muhammad. Alamat wa lamhdi wa salam tasima. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa taala uh, to count this for us as a help. And inshallah, yani it will help. Our families from Ansar al Mahdi alayhim salam that need to be released from the imprisonments and from these um, courts that have been uh, and, and these uh, events that have happened recently. Ya Allah, Allah Musalli ala Muhammad wa Ali Muhammad, Alam Matul Mahdi wa Salam Taslima. There's a few things that I would like to tell you guys. Uh, at the beginning of the protest, we came in very peacefully, <coughs> and we, um, most of the Ansar stood on the other side, because the consulate was on the 11th floor, and then we all stood on the other side of the street, holding our signs and holding our banners, and we were just holding them protesting peacefully. Ya Allah. اللهم صل على محمد وآل محمد الأمة واليهدين وسلم تسليما كثيرا. I guess that is will what we will get when we get our room in the Middle East. We get people like Mandir or whatever his name is. يا الله. اللهم صل على محمد وآل محمد الأمة والمهدين وسلم تسليما. Yes, uh, things I was going to tell you about. Uh, two of the Ansar have went up after the consulate, and they had a foul with them, with all the letters and our demands within that file. And the weird thing is that uh, the Iraqi ambassador in, in Sydney. What's his name? Muhsin, Muhsin the Samarai. When the Ansar went up to him, it was only two Ansar who went up to him, and he they told him that we have, uh, we have a protest going on our side. We have started it now because uh, we have a permit. We got a permit from the federal police in Australia with this protest. So we came in and informed them. We showed them the permit, and we said we have a protest. We would like you to hear us. And these are our demands. We would like to give you this file with all our demands to hand in to any, the President of Iraq or Al-Maliki who is in position of the, the, the government or the President of Iraq at the moment. However, he has refused and he seemed very, very upset from what we were doing. And he actually threatened to call, the, uh, to call the police, and he did call the police at the end. However, we, the police were just downstairs with us, and the police were so compassionate with us because they told us that they are there, the police are there with us to protect us, and they told us that we have the right to be heard, and they wished for our voices to be 
heard by everyone. Yes, so it was our right to be heard, and they were actually protecting us. However, that council, he actually called the police against us. We have done nothing wrong. I guess this is a part of their government. What they do in Iraq, the same people come in and do the same in Australia. They think they still live in that jungle with no, with no rules, with no constitution. Anyway, uh, we have sent, um, like one of the cops has actually offered to go and talk to him so he can, like, to set out really, like, um, to be really blank, to, to, to set the story right, because we did not understand why he was very, very upset, and the cops didn't even get what he was upset about. So one of the cops actually uh, volunteered and said that he was going to go out by himself because he did get a call from the council telling them to come in, uh, urging them to help. So he said that he will go up and he will uh, see what is what did they call about. Anyway, he came back with no news at all. He said he just wouldn't take, and it is his right not to take any, any of uh, anything that you would you would hand it in, like anything that you would hand it to. But Subhanallah, yani, yani we we ask Allah Subhanahu wa Taala to inshallah يعني, khwana, like to free our brothers free our families from the prisoners and for these protests all over the world to inshallah be heard if not by the consulate not by the Iraq consulate but by the people by anyone who can do or who can help inshallah and at the end, al Allah and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the one who has everything in his hand. Ya Allah. Allahumma salli ala Muhammadin wa ali Muhammad alamat wal mahdi wa sallam taslima. Other than that, yani, the protest went well. There were so many people coming in and we had handouts although they could not they could not do much to help us but they just wanted to know why are these massive amount of people sign up in the street protesting against that Iraqi council what have they done again some of the people have actually asked what have they done again and a lot of the answer were just talking to all the people and then people were standing with us um, yes they would just want to hear about this and want to know uh, what was the protest about and a lot of them were actually giving us ideas Not a lot of, like a lot of them were, were coming in and and, and, and uh, it, it's as if they were part of it already Although they had no idea what was going on, but, you know, just to read these signs, you know, 24 people sentenced to, to death penalty uh, with no fair justice, and 15 of them to life sentence. Why is that? Where are the human rights? Where is the justice? So, as you know, these are all like attention grabbers and we hope that it did what we intended for it to do and that is in the beginning uh, to satisfy يعني, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because we have done it Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala 
It is not them, the consulate, nor the Iraq government that can help us. It is only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that can help us. Uh, the protest was full of uh, most of the Ansar in Australia has um, came in. Not all of them could, but uh, most of them. Um, we couldn't really keep count, but it, it was like, um, if I'm not sure, it was a um, hundred or around that number. Fi Allah, sister, take care of yourself, inshallah. Do not forget the Imam in your du'a and, and the Ansar, our brothers and sisters. Yeah, inshallah. Um, yeah. There were, like the families were, you know, mashallah, a lot of them. Yes, exactly. And yeah, subhanallah. Uh, we came in, we were actually looking for the Ansar. We came in, we, we had, uh, uh, we were looking where the Ansar were, but they were actually um, um, in, a, in a bigger area away from the embassy, uh, sorry, away from the consulate. And when we saw them, they, yeah, yeah mashallah. Uh, they were like a fudge. They were like waves of people. Well, mashallah, a thousand in Iraq today. Inshallah. يا الله اللهم صل على محمد وآل محمد ألمة والمهدين وسلم تسليما. But just to see, like, um, this is from personal experience. I have not seen that many Ansar in one place before, and today was my first day to see that many Ansar all gathered around like that. And yani, mashallah, mashallah, mashallah. Yani, uh, the whole atmosphere, it was, when you were there, it, it was as if you were just one person. Yani, everyone in there had the same, that said the same thing. And everyone in there was as if they were one whole big family. We all shared. يعني, the same compassion about this matter and yeah subhanallah a lot of us were actually um, yeah, without even thinking we were thinking the same thing w without even knowing um, like subhanallah I called I called one of the um, TV stations and I have told them about the um, Protest, and I have um, offered them to come and, um, and 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 film it. But they told me that literally, literally, a lady called one minute ago, um, telling us about the same protest. So I was like, oh, inshallah, khair. ya Allah. They said that someone has already called a minute ago one of the sisters and the one of the Ansar sisters. Um, that TV session did not show up. However, it is just I thought I would mention that small incident. But the place we were at, it was a very, like, uh, it was a very busy place, and 